September 28, 2000. Ariel Sharon, at the time Israel's hardline opposition leader, visits Jerusalem's Temple Mount. His visit to the sacred site, claimed by both Jews and Muslims, sparks violent clashes between Israelis and Palestinians. And it fuels a political crisis within Israel, where Sharon is elected prime minister the following year. 1781. The final battle of the Revolutionary War begins. American forces, backed by a French fleet, begin the siege of Yorktown Heights, Virginia. Weeks later, British forces surrender to General George Washington, effectively ending the war. 1066. William the Conqueror, the Duke of Normandy, part of what's now France, invades England. He becomes king after his conquest sweeps the country's Anglo-Saxon monarchy from power. 1924. End of the first round-the-world flight as two U.S. Army planes land in Seattle. Their journey took 175 days, making stops in dozens of cities along the way. 1989. Ferdinand Marcos, the deposed leader of the Philippines, dies in exile in Hawaii at age 72. That happens three years after the People Power Movement topples Marcos, ending his years of authoritarian rule in Manila. And 1991. Jazz musician Miles Davis dies in Santa Monica, California. He was 65. Today in History, September 28th, Camille Bohan and the Associated Press.